Hello everyone, it's me Chebby from Inic Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'll show you how to easily find out any motherboard CPU socket types with model number in Windows. So, without any further more delay, let's begin. So, before processing, just let me show you. They are mainly consists of three different CPU socket types that is the PGA, BGA, and LGA. So, the PGA stands for pin grid array and the BGA stands for ball grid array and the LGA stands for the LAN grid array. So most commonly you will see this any one of these three CPU socket types. So by seeing this you can predict what it is model number. So the model number may be different but the main types will be either any one of these three. So I have shown you a little details about this CPU socket types so we'll find out what is the motherboard CPU socket types with the model number for our respective Windows computer so for this what you need to do just open any web browser and in the Google search just search for the application name as CPU Z and on the first list it will see its official website just click on it now just scroll down below so here you will see a download option so you can see the first one is a setup and second one is a zip file so i will generally choose the zip file you can download a setup file also so i will start downloading wait for a few seconds until the complete downloading is done Finally, the download has been completed. So let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded and let me close the web browser. So you can see here it's a zip file. Just double click it to extract the file. So under the folder, you can see here two different types of CPU Z applications. So you can see one is for 32 bit and one is for 64 bit. So if you're using a 32 bit processor then you need to use this CPU Z32 and if you're using a 64 bit processor then you can use this both the 32 as well as 64 so I'll just use this the bottom one that is the 64 bit I'll just right click on it and I'll just run it as administrator wait for a few seconds So finally you can see here under the CPU headings you can see in the package list right. So the socket type I'm having is uh, 1155 that is the model number and the type of my CPU socket type is the LGA. So let me show you the picture again so you can see here. So I'm having this kind of socket type that is the CPU socket type that is the LGA line grid array which is mostly seen in most of the desktop and laptop computers so you can see I'm using here right now is the this kind of CPU socket types so you might find different also like bold grid array and PG8 that is the pin grid array also it's not that in every computer you will see only LGA in other computers also you may see the PG and the PG also so right now we have confirmed that in my computer I'm having a LGA with the model number 1155. So what is the importance of knowing this kind of CPU socket types and uh, serial number is that when you process any motherboards then you will see a processor sockets right so you must note that there may be some serial numbers and what type of sockets it is so before processing any processor that is if you are processing a Intel or AMD processors then you must note that it should have the same socket supporting types that is if the socket type that is the CPU socket type is 115A LGA then it should match with your processor whether it is an Intel or the AMD so it will help you to get the perfect fit for your respective CPU sockets if you know the CPU socket types with its model number so this can be very helpful in the future if you want to assemble your respective desktop computers then knowing this CPU socket types with the 
model number will be very beneficial for you in future so this is how you can easily find out any model zip motherboards cpu socket types with model numbers in windows very easily so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching